Hello, let's do the New York Times Hard Sudoku for October 24th, 2025. There's a link in the description if you'd like to try the puzzle yourself, and I'm going to get started right now. All right, we have this five and six, um, two fives here. This five helps, puts a five in one of these two in this box. We have two sixes. This six looks up, placing the six in this box. We can follow up. Six is in one of these two. All right. So I think that's all we get from the five and the six. I will note that these two cells see one, two, three, four, five, eight. So I think they're worth marking. Um, so they're not one, two, three, four, five. They can be six, seven, nine. And the bottom one's not even nine. All right, six, seven, huh? <laughs> all right, uh, three, four, and six in here. So I'm noticing the three looks in here. Um, none of these are three. So the three is in one of these two. It's going to point in here with this three. This three looks up, placing this three. All right, these threes look in here, putting a three right there. Can I keep following up with threes? I think that's, I mean, we have these threes, but I think that's all we get. Um, this is a filled box column now, so we want to look at these digits that aren't already placed. So not the three. So the five and the two are not yet placed in this box. They end up over here. Um, this bottom one's not two, the top one, or the middle one's not five. But So those are going to point. So the two looks up. These twos point up, putting a two in one of these two. And then the five points down along with this five. This five looks in, putting a five in one of these two. All right, that's quite nice. So that was from something. Oh, I have these threes. I missed that. Threes in one of these two. So that was from these threes here. Um, this rows down to three digits. Let's just take a look. We need a one, uh, seven, eight, one, seven, eight. Only thing I see is this one here. Um, All right, anything else from this three, four, and six? We do have two sixes, though. We got that already. Four is in one of these two in this box. That might be helpful. These are avoiding some corner marks. Not one, two, three, four, six. They're also not five. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> so they're from uh, seven, eight, nine, then. They're not one, two, three, four, five, six. So these are both from seven, eight, nine, and that one's not even a nine. All right. Well, I just noticed these ones. Let's put a one of these two. All right. Um, anything with this box before we move on? Five, six, two, nine. So we do have the two twos. It's a two in one of these two. Uh, the two fives look down along with this one, putting a five in one of these two. The six, no good. And then the nine, we do have two nines. And this nine helps placing this nine. So now we're down to two places for three. So we still can't place it, but. Uh, let's follow up on these nines here. Nine's one of these three. All right, anything else in this band that I might want to take a look at? Um, let's hold off. Let's just move on to the next band. So we have one, three, four, eight. So we got the two ones. Oh, but this one looks down and this one looks across. Does anything else do that? Uh, only the five would be able to. Unfortunately, it doesn't. So I mean, I'm just looking at these digits here. We already have two and three placed. And then the five, uh, the five looks in here, but I already have it marked. Um, so it's just the, uh, it's just, it's just the one, sorry. I forgot which digit, <laughs> and I couldn't find it again. Anyway, one and one of those two. That points up with this one, putting a one and one of these two. We do want to look for one in this row, but it can be here, here, or here. So not super helpful. All right, um, so we learned these aren't one. Is that enough to do anything? Doesn't look like it. Okay. So that was this one. We have the three, does not appear useful. Uh, the four, no, and then the eight. We do have two eights here. So eight does end in one of these three. All right, we have this one and two. Noticing one and two need to go in these three cells somewhere. This one's not a one, this one's not a two, but it doesn't help enough. All right, that's really all I'm seeing. The corollary is we need three, four, and five in these cells. 
Um, the four and the five. There we go. So we have four and five looking in here, and then four and five looking into the box this way. Then we have this one and two. So four, uh, we could corner mark fives here, but we can do better because these corner marks are telling us, the four and the five corner marks, are telling us that one of these two cells needs to be a four and the other needs to be a five. So that doesn't leave room for them to be anything other than four or five. That's called a hidden pair. And so that removed our six corner mark from here. If this was a six, I would have to put a four and a five in this cell. Can't do that. So this is our six. And this is now three, seven, eight, nine. So this is three, seven, nine. This is also three, seven, and it's not even, not even nine. Uh, so what's the, what's the nine doing in this box? The nine's one of these two. That points up with this nine. This nine looks in, placing the nine, which also places the five, giving us the f resolving the four or five pair. That resolves our five and two in this box, which resolves the two in this box. Very nice. This is six, seven. It cannot be nine, so that places the nine. Uh, and that places the nine and the eight in this box. All right. Clear out this eight. Um, one, seven for the column. What's the box need? One, two, seven, eight. So the two is one of these two. In fact, there's just a triple. Let's get rid of these corner marks. There's just a triple for this column. We need a one, two, eight. One, two, eight. I mean, the bottom one's not two, but that's all I see. Uh, we know the bottom one's not two because the, the box needs the two to be in one of these two. So um, it points down. Um, so that's not seven, right? So seven's in one of these two. So that points le left, saying that's not a seven, leaving one eight behind. All right, this whole column is uh, one, six, seven, eight. This can't be a one, so this is six, seven, eight. This can't be a six, this is one, seven, eight. It also can't be that six. <laughs> All right, um, let's look at this row. We need a three, six, seven. The six can only go here in the, in the row. The six looks down. So this is down to three, seven. Uh, oh, we have a six, seven pair here, that, so this can't be seven. So that's three, that's seven, that's three. This, uh, oh, that places the three and the five in this box, which places the five in this box. All right. This is, a, this is known as well. This is a four. It's the only place for four in the row. And then this is a pair. It's going to be the one and whatever's missing, the seven. All right. This can't be a three anymore. That places this three. Four digits uh, left in this box. We need a one, four, seven, eight. Well, this can't be one, four. So this is down to seven, eight. Surprisingly unrestricted otherwise. That means this column is also one, four, seven, eight. And this can't be the one, so this is four, seven, eight. Oh, it's not an eight either. Sorry, it's not, oh, sorry, the eight looks up. Uh, so I must have missed something there. Anyway, um, so the eight's in one of these two. That points saying this isn't an eight. All right, I don't think we can do anything with that. These aren't eights either. So hold on, so this box was one, four, seven, eight. These aren't eight, so these are one, four, seven. And so the eight in this column, sorry, not the eight. Uh, what's the other digit in this column? Um, the, I was gonna say the four, not the four. It's the six, we need a six in this column, that goes there. All right, we know this, uh, the, the four is in one of these two in this box, and so then this, sorry, for the call, sorry, this is claiming, right? The column claims the four from the box. The column needs a four. It's going to be here or here because it can't be here. Wherever it ends up, it'll be the four for this box as well, meaning this can't also be a four. So this is down to one, seven, eight. All right. This column's down to seven, eight. This can't be a six anymore, so it's down to seven, eight. Ah, so six in this column goes here. That's a six. That's a seven. Um, four, seven, eight here. Okay. Did I miss anything obvious? Um, we do have two sixes here, and the six looks down. So this is six, and then this is one, giving us the seven and the one, and the seven, two, eight. We get the eight here, the two here. That's seven and one. That's our one. That is not a seven. Four or eight. Actually, it's not resolved. That's not a one anymore. This is down to four or seven. The seven tells us the order. That's four and seven. That's eight, one, and four. That's one and seven. That's seven. All right, we have this four, eight pair still. Uh, I guess I'll just do this triple here. We need a two, four, eight. So the two can only go here because of this two. And this is down to four, eight. I'll have four, eight pairs. Uh, this is also four, eight, but it's not an eight. So that's four, eight, four, eight, four. 
And then uh, these two digits, we know one's a nine. It's eight, nine. This eight tells the order, so that's nine, that's eight. And then the last two digits are seven and nine, and we're done. Wow, just under 10 minutes, all right. It's hard to be under 10 minutes with explanations. <laughs> Let's put it that way. Um, cool, well, um, the puzzle just kind of solved. Uh, I don't know, there, there was some pointing and claiming and some pairs and stuff, but they just kind of were, at least with, with the, my method of solving, not too hard to spot. All right, well, let me know how you did. And if you enjoyed this, why not leave a like, subscribe, and a kind comment below.